You know, the summer months are the most dangerous time for teenage drivers. News 4 traffic anchor Lindsay Nance is breaking down the reasons why and what's being done to make the roads safer. Hey, yeah, Chris, and teenagers in the next 100 days are four times more likely to die from a car crash than COVID-19. That's the latest message from the National Road Safety Foundation. Researchers say they hope those numbers inspire parents to have a life-saving conversation. Last year, 125 teen drivers were involved in deadly crashes in our state. That's a 21% increase from 2016 to 2019. The summer is the most dangerous. The number of deadly teen crashes triples. Teens are out of school. They um, are going to the beaches. They're hanging out with their friends. You have more daylight for driving. And with today's technology, more distractions. Now, Anderson and her staff are partnering with Students Against Destructive Decisions, or SAD, to raise awareness. Anderson and her team are trying to reach teens where they are, on social media. She plans to use Facebook and Twitter to post messages aimed at young drivers. As a parent, there are simple ways you can help, too. And we're encouraging parents and adults uh, to make sure that they're buckling up and that they are being the perfect role model for the teen drivers who are observing us while we're in these cars. Now, researchers say one of the easiest ways to help your teen drivers stay safe is to limit how many people are in the car with them. Fewer passengers means fewer distractions. Chris.